I'd say the best things about being born are the large range of people you meet and the amount of extracurricular activities you can do. I really love the theatre here, I think it's awesome. The energy around the school is really, really good and the students are really lovely. The teachers are good, the students here are good, it's got a good community feel. I think the best thing would be the group of people I'm surrounded by, friends that I've made throughout the school year. I chose to come here for sixth form because it was quite convenient because I already live in Bourne and also the English department here is really strong which is something I want to do in my career later on in life. I chose to come to Bourne Grammar because I knew that this was the school where I'd be getting the support that I needed and I'd have the facilities to study the range of subjects I wanted to as well. I'm already familiar with the staff and with the students and I respect them both a lot. Throughout my time here from Year 7 to 11 I'd gained a lot of trust in my teachers here and also in my group of friends here. My favourite subject is English language because it's a big difference from GCSE to A-level. My favourite subject is biology because you get to learn about the inner workings of animals and human bodies. It's really great being a sixth form student here as you're really well supported. No matter whether it's in class or outside of class, the teachers are always trying to help you. They are there to help you and they want to help you, which I think is another great thing about being here at Bourne. You're surrounded by teachers that are enthused about you making progress in your academic subjects. They provide us with a lot of resources just to make sure that as well as being in school, you're studying outside of school and gaining that extra knowledge. I'd say the biggest difference when you enter the sixth form to lower school is that you are expected to take responsibility for your learning, but that ultimately leads to you becoming really involved and passionate about the subjects that you study. I think one major way we're treated differently is by the teachers. They start to treat you as near adults instead of secondary school students. For me, the biggest difference was the difference in freedom. In freeze and stuff, you get to leave, obviously. You have that much more independence and you will notice that you actually are treated more like an, a young adult now more so than ever before and that's something that I think is really liberating. I chose subjects that complemented each other so I had interest in English and drama and so I found that media also fed into English and drama and they complemented each other really well. The subjects that I chose were biology, chemistry and psychology. I always knew that I wanted to do medicine at university so Biology and chemistry, I needed to take those for the course. Um, I also love biology and chemistry, so this wasn't a huge problem for me. Psychology, I've always been interested in psychology, and um, Bourne Grammar School offers psychology at A-level, which really, really interested me, so that was the obvious choice for me to choose. I really enjoy it now. You need to choose the subjects you can envision yourself enjoying studying, that if you saw on your timetable, would make you smile. I definitely recommend if anyone's struggling, have a look at what you want to do and what you like. If you have a certain profession or a certain job in mind, do research into it, go backwards from the job and try and figure out what qualifications and what things are very useful in it. What three words would sum up your experience? Oh, I'm trying to think of them. We really, this. really tiring. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Independent. Liberating. Interesting. Interesting. Enjoyable. Enjoyable. Sociable. Challenging. Challenging. Rewarding. Intense. Motivating. Inspiring. Fun. Fun. If A-levels are what you want to do, I really suggest you come here because it's a really, really good school.